done with neuro, done with six whole weeks of neuro. Uh, I just had my neuro final. Hopefully this is the last time that I'm going to be seeing neuro until boards because six weeks I've had enough of it and I was so ready to move on. I hope the exam went well. I hope I don't have to retake anything and I hope that I am actually fully done with neuro. And on to psych. And psych already is going to start tomorrow. So uh, not really a break, which is fine. I don't really feel like I need a day or a weekend. I feel fine to jump right into psych. And I'm excited because I really like psychology. I was a psychology minor, so I always had an interest in psych. As always, after exams, I'll be spending the rest of my day getting the rest of my life together as I have abandoned a lot of things while I was studying for the exam. So I'm gonna go heat up some food because I think my brain ate through all the glucose and everything I had to offer for breakfast because I am starving. And then after I eat, I wanna go ahead to the gym and get back into my gym routine and yeah, we'll see where the rest of the day takes me. But I wanna I wanna start it organized. I wanna I wanna start it in an organized fashion for psych. Now that Nero's done, all this time to catch up on everything else, first thing I'm gonna do, I have 6,500 emails, so I have to go through the emails. So I'm gonna go through my emails, organize that, see what's going on at school. Other thing that has, you know, fallen into the back pocket with all this is clinical skills and OMEM. Apparently we have an OMEM assessment coming up next week and um, it's where we're gonna have to actually diagnose each other for upper extremity, low extremity, and the entire back. So go through our whole assessment, find a diagnosis, give our diagnoses, and then I think the facilitator gets to pick which one um, they want us to try and fix. And then we have to pull out of our um, OMEM brain bank and try to use whichever OMEM we know to fix that problem and actually fix it because then they will recheck it. They will find the somatic dysfunction that we found and then they will see if it got resolved and grade us on that. So I'm gonna organize all my OCS and OMEM PowerPoints, presentations, everything I have now. So it's my activity for the next hour or so. monkey cards that I also have to do today um, that I backlogged because I didn't finish all of them for the last two days so I don't know if I'm gonna get through the whole 600 of them but uh, I'll do my best and I think I'll just move the rest of them forward ignore this no longer gonna be doing that because no more neuro Oh my gosh, we had the longest day today. Today was our first day of psych lectures, which was really fun. I love psychology, so I'm really excited to start the system. But this is the first time that we did four hours of lecture, had a break, and then had four more hours of lecture. So in all psych, so all one subject. And it was pretty interesting. It was an intro, a background to psychology. Um, we started the drugs. There's a lot of drugs to go through. And then we had some psych in relation to uh, neuroanatomy, so kind of time it back to neuro that we just went through. Also really happy to say that I did pass my second neuro exam and I passed neuro overall so I don't have to worry about that and I'm I have a fresh start and I'm moving on to psych. I'm very tired today. I also just got back from the gym. For whatever reason, my body got used to going to bed at like two, three in the morning, I think with like studying for neuro and the exams. So yesterday when I went to bed at like 11, I basically couldn't fall asleep until three in the morning. So now that I've only gone like three hours of sleep last night and I'm exhausted from today, I really hope that I can fall asleep earlier. So I'm just gonna study in bed and not study a lot more since I already studied for eight hours today. Yeah, hopefully get enough sleep and then uh, do it all again tomorrow.
did 1,048 cards yesterday. Hopefully I can recreate something similar today. It's Saturday and I've basically not done a single thing today except go to the beach and get sunburned as you can tell. I maybe did like 200 Anki cards. I did watch two Boards and Beyond videos this morning on Psych and I'm just working through the cards that are associated with those two videos but honestly all in all I like barely studied today which is not great. I'm gonna go for a run and then hopefully get my life together and actually attempt to study something today. They get confusion and give them back glucose and the confusion resolves. So